Buyer beware. Take three precautions before you buy that new condominium or townhome. Hi, I'm Deborah Yelvington of Dynamic Permits, and I've been working with real estate agents and property owners, new owners, for over 20 years. And I've come to find out that not all homes that are listed have proper COs in order when they do. So here's three cautions that you can take so that you don't get stuck with a permit pickle. Number one is request a copy of the property survey from the seller. Now, you probably know a condominium is usually attached to other units in the building. And the property that you would be buying is limited to the boundaries of usually that dwelling to the outer walls. Now, sometimes the original builder got permission to add on balconies overhanging or rear decks, but you wanna verify before you purchase that property, where exactly would your boundaries lie? Number two is beware of those listings that boast newly renovated kitchen or extended back deck with outdoor kitchen, because that might signal that the seller has done additional work, more recent work than the original builder received permits and COs for. So you want to ask the seller if they've got the contact information for contractors that maybe replace that kitchen, because if they're willing to share that information, then it adds credibility to the work that was done. Number three is verify that any of those home improvements were done under proper building permits and received certificates of occupancy or CO. So you can either ask the seller to provide copies of those documents to you, or you can go down to the local building department for that property that you're looking into. Uh, because when you purchase that property, you become responsible for everything that's going on inside there. So if you purchase it without verifying those documents are in order, then you're responsible. And when it catches up to you, which it usually does, it becomes quite costly for you to have to do the permits that were left out by the previous owner. And you can avoid a permit pickle by verifying that information at the building department. Or if the terminology is very foreign to you, you can always contact a permit professional. If you reach out to us through the link below, Dynamic Permits will give you a free 15 minute consultation that we keep confidential, but we'll verify the information so that you can purchase your condo and avoid getting stuck in a permit pickle. Thanks for watching.